I can't explain it over the phone. You'll see it when you get here. Come to Serpent Creek, please. You're my only hope. How's everyone doing? It's your Gibbs, and we've got a game for you. With this is called a Nine Clues: The Secret of Serpent Creek. Now, this is an Artifacts Monday uh, production, but it also has uh, Topic Games. I think is the one that actually did the game development, and I think Artifacts just published it. But nonetheless, it is a partnership for sure, and we're going to go ahead and dive right in. I am a huge fan of Artifacts Monday. If you haven't already seen, uh, I've recorded a whole bunch of their games, and I'll leave a few of them uh, linked as, uh, in the video description. So check all those out. Obviously, if you want to go over here, you can see some of the stuff I've played. I have played, yes, the Abyss. Have I played that one? I think I have. I've played that one. I've played that one. Oh, of course, all the Nightmares from the Deep. So yeah, so check these out. I have uh, thoroughly enjoyed all of the Artifix Monday games. So. With that being said, let's get into Serpent Creek. Let's hit the play button. So we got a couple different casual, advanced, and expert mode. I like how the faces change. Hehe. <laughs> we'll go ahead and play on casual mode. Dealing with the supernatural is always a challenge. But the most challenging case I ever received came from my longtime friend, Helen Hunter. She had gone with her assistant to Serpent Creek to report on the local festival. Stammering and sobbing, she asked for my help. It sounded serious enough. Before the call broke off, she said she had uncovered a horrible secret. I should find a room and begin my search first thing tomorrow morning. What is that thing? I don't know, but it's creeping me out. Alright, the gear cursor appears whenever you can interact with an object. <laughs> that was close. I need to get out of the car. That looked like some sort of serpent creature. Whoa, what's going on here? You can pick up objects with the hand cursor. Some objects can be used with other objects. I see we gotta put this one back in. Some objects cannot be collected and can only be used for their surroundings. Huh. What? What happened? Who are you? <laughs> A giant reptile creature. Have you been drinking? Oh, I'm sorry. That was rude. Thank you for your help. I I'll explain later. Please, come in. Okay, so we've dealt with that, have we? Uh, go to our journal. This is the character section. When you find information about the people you meet on your adventure, it will be stored here. The objective section contains your current objectives. Completed ones are marked in gray. Clues. The clue section contains information connected to your investigation. Question marks indicate clues you haven't uncovered yet. Huh. A monster. I was attacked by a giant reptile. Its posture resembles that of a human. The size of its teeth suggests otherwise. It's big, fast, and hungry. Where's my backup when I need it? So we got false and black. The hotel manager doesn't seem to recall a giant reptilian creature. Or passing out. Oh, I hear kitty cats. Do you hear that kitty cat? I hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't, we're not ready to travel yet. I want to touch this. No, I want to touch the kitty yet. Okay, fine. Yes, I could do hints if I wanted to, but I don't want to. It's the last day of Serpent Creek Snake Festival. <laughs> Why is that the worst idea for a festival? Oh, it feels like it's the worst idea to me. I'll take that town map. The bell is broken, the top part is missing. Uh-uh-uh. Guest book's full. And it wouldn't interest you anyway. Sorry about before. Forgot to take my meds is all. 
What brings you to Serpent Creek, anyway? You're looking for someone. Helen Hunter. Nope, it doesn't ring a bell. Sorry. Let me fix you up with a room. It's the least I can do, right? Here, keys to room eight. Why, thank you. So how am I supposed to get in there? Hmm. The mechanism needs repair. Some of the gears are missing. Please take care of this as soon as you can, Mr. Black. What a nice landscape. Okay, so let's go upstairs, I suppose. Whoa, Whoa what is that? A giant snake. <laughs> Called it. Alright, let's look at our uh, interface here. So we have our journal, of course. We've got our menu business here, which is kind of cool. Uh, we have a map here. This is nice. This is a uh, Serpent Creek's quite big from the looks of it. Got a lovely lighthouse over there. Uh, obviously, we've got a nice little lock here for inventory. And then our hint button. So let's have a look here first. Visit our famous snake museum. Encounter deadly reptiles and see ancient treasures. Yeah, maybe I should check that out. I'll take that to gear. This room is obviously occupied. It's all filthy there, too. Yeah, no kidding. He needs a doormat. Locked up tight. The light's all flickery. Okay, we saw that already. Door number eight. Oh, wow. I need seven gears. Ha <laughs> ha. Room number eight. That's not creepy at all. I like the little, like, shavings that show up. The art style in this game is incredible. Don't drink the blank... Blank? The black mamba. I don't know, who was that? If you don't secure your wardrobe, someone might commit a crime of fashion. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Wardrobe key. Source. Source? Source of what? Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, the date markings ended two days ago. I'll take that paper clip. What's with the Elvis dude? King himself. H. Could the box belong to Helen? It could. Let's go ahead and open that door up. Whoa, holy cow. Sparkles! Let's go. We gotta collect everything. Uh, smoke. Oh wait, what's this? No. Voodoo doll. Hmm. Playing cards. Eight ball. Yep. Oh look at that. We can put that in the voodoo doll. Oh my goodness, that creeped me out. Voodoo doll is creepy. Sunglasses, camera film. A flask. Where the heck's this bar of soap that we need? Now, smoke. Where am I putting this? Into a pipe, I would think. Aha! Light that up. Helen Box Key. Candy. Guess someone didn't like the snakes. People here are very strange. I've noticed that the locals are acting sleepy and slow. Most of them stay inside all day. There's also something shady about the hotel manager. Maybe Joe will be able to learn something about Mr. Black. Hmm. Is that a firecracker? Hey, what is this suitcase doing here? Whoa, where were I you? I must ask you to leave the room, now. It hasn't been serviced yet. Here, take this card and go for a, a walk or something. Take a tour around town. Don't come back until I'm finished with the room. Okay, he is definitely shady character. 
of that room that he just basically told me to get back in. Hey! Who's there? <laughs> Good cat. Aw, we have to make friends. Here, have a firecracker. Aw, don't want a firecracker? <laughs> Take a horn then. I need something sharp. This van belongs to Helen's magazine. She has to be somewhere in town. Fair enough. Have to figure out how to unlock that. Oh, no, 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 we're not going to skip. Move the tourist from the start point to the orange token. Okay, well, it's got to go this way. Oh, come on. I didn't want to drag it that way. I want to drag it this way. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's see if I can figure this one out now. Yes, yeah, so I want to go here, then there. Another tremor. This one even stronger than the last. Rattlesnake. As cheesy as it gets. Yep. So that's what the tremors were all about. During your adventure, you may want to use the map. This is the map screen. Next available action is indicated in red. Huh. Yeah, the art style in this game is incredible. Try our famous black mamba drink. No, no, no. I'll, I'll pass. Thank you. What the devil is wrong with you? What's wrong with this dude? Good evening. My name is Alist Braminus, mayor of Serpent Creek. At your service. Oh, he's whistling. As you are aware that we just experienced a minor underground tremor. Nothing of concern, really. Unfortunately. I'm not able to reach Sheriff Wilson and inform him about the damages. Your friend went missing here. This is unexpected. Sheriff Wilson will be more than happy to help you. His office is down the street, across the town square. Now we need to find a way to reach the town square if we are to locate your missing friend. Okay, so I'm not supposed to trust him right away. <laughs> Ooh, look at the snake here. Is that blood? That's creepy. Hey, you want a firecracker? Oh wow, that actually worked. Hey, what the? What the heck's going on here? Well, found it here at least. Scrap of a peculiar shirt. Somebody's coughing here. Oh, it's a crime what scene. What on earth happened here? Crime. This is your nine clues scene here. Alright, so we're in detective mode. Your goal is to find trails and clues hidden across the scene. First we'll flash with close to a trail. It's the reverse hidden object scene, it's so cool. 
Let's see what the evidence says. This is a retrospective. Short paragraphs regard all the evidence you've gathered. You can advance to the next paragraph when the continue button is available. Uh... The perpetrator stands in the corner, occupied with something. <gasps> Suddenly, he feels a pair of eyes at his back. The perpetrator rushes at the intruder. Adrenaline takes over and he kills the intruder with a hammer. He then puts on gloves and drags the victim's body across the garage. The killer loses his balance and leans on the locker door. He pushes the door hard, leaving then the killer puts away the gloves. Wipes away the evidence and puts the ammonia bottle back on the shelf. He wipes down the murder tool, finishes his cigarette, and walks away. That means I scared off someone else. And the victim's body must be in the locker. Oh no. Is it? Goodness, what are we doing here? Use the buttons to rotate the lock, pick mechanism, and turn all the snakes' heads green. Oh, it's one of these things, is it? I see how it is. About this uh, style game. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, I think I got it. Awesome. I was right! And I recognize the victim. It's Joe, Helen's co-worker. These are Joe's keys. Let's see what's in that van outside the hotel. Keep away from the lighthouse. Finish your story and get out of here as soon as you can. Someone tried to warn him. Guess he didn't heed the advice of his friends. What the heck's going on here? Creepy. It is a mess. Ooh, what do we have here? An object scene, yay! Uh, a handle without a head? That is not a handle at all. Bottle of wine over there. Let's put the wine on. Give myself a spark. Got an ashtray somewhere around here. And a rat. Oh, that was a dead rat. That I did not expect. Okay, a lug wrench. This is an adjustable wrench here. Oh, a lug wrench right there. Car jack. That's actually going to be super handy. Huh. That's weird. He's been around for a long time, though. Let's go back. Why don't in the back of this truck? A rope of some sort. This is insane. Joe took a picture of some kind of creature. We need to send it to the publisher right away. It's not a human, yeah, that's for sure. Uh, carjack handle and a tow rope. 
why would I need a card jackhammer? Hi there. What? A dead body? Goodness. This is truly shocking. You need to inform the sheriff immediately. Where is he? I guess I should go back to my hotel room. Not sure what I'm gonna be jacking up here. What's my map say? Yeah, Rattlesnake Hotel. Ooh, he's not here. Jill Valentine, yay! Risen Evil. She was the one with the red thing in her chest. Huh. Yeah, we kind of knew her room was number eight. What's this? Some tunnels of some sort. He will be back in any minute, will he? So why won't I... Why won't it let me get there? Lock up tight. Whoa, okay, we gotta do this, don't we? Oh, maybe we gotta jack it up. Uh, maybe just jack it. That is totally treacherous. <laughs> Who's climbing across here? I don't want well to. Well done. You seem to be full of surprises. And I must make some arrangements. Please, make haste. Alright, well, before we get too much further into Creepy Serpent Creek, we're going to take a break here, and we'll see you in the next video. Let me know what you're thinking of the game so far. I would always love to hear your thoughts down in the comments below. I'm your Gibbs, and we'll see you next time.